a very simple physical challenge that each of you've got to face. You've got to get the darkest dark, and you've got to achieve that with really different strategies, and you have to get the lightest light, and you have to then, through the placement and arrangement, try to construct these so that they produce the illusion of a surface. I think ultimately 201, I like to describe it as um, drawing the invisible, drawing around and through things that you can't really see. And I think that's, that's the other cool part of this class is that while it starts without a bias for a particular end goal, like being an architect or being an engineer, um, it really just takes on form, form and line. In the second half, we really start moving in with the drawing's capacity to x-ray, to look into how things are assembled, how they're constructed, what produces the illusions of these surfaces. So it's both a tool of analysis and synthesis. Um, generation and reflection. We're starting with very simple subjects um, like a wood block for example like this. Um, you know we could think about its box, its outline, or we could think about its nature, its character, its surface condition, and the inseparability of that core coming to the surface, right? Can you, by observing the life, the grain of the wood, can you put that in service of the box, you know, like actually seeing the edges? So we take really seemingly simple problems like this and we, we dive into them in terms of, you know, how, to, how does drawing expose this as a, as a problem?